With this short video tutorial, we will show you how easy it is to get your workforce up and running very easily. If you don't already have 3CX up and running, you can take advantage of our offer to provide the PBX for free and we will also host it for you for six months. You can find the link to our special offer page directly from our website. Fill in the form and you will be issued a license key for free. Once you fill out the form, you will receive an email which will give you certain options. You will see your license key. You can also install on-premise, in the cloud, or you can use the free 3CX hosting. Just click on the link and you will start the PBX Express wizard. Select the country that you wish to deploy through. Select the time zone and select the language of the prompt set. Select your FQDN. 3CX does provide a free FQDN and SSL certificate as well. If the host name you want is taken under the domain, either choose a different domain or select a different host name. Select your extension digit length. Select your region. Choose something which is close to you. And click on finish. Accept the terms in the license agreement and you are on your way to having your free PBX set up. And just like that, our PBX is ready. When the PBX has been set up, you will be able to log in and start configuring your PBX. We will focus on the internal communications of your employees first. You can very easily create extensions for each of your users. With the setup of the PBX, the first extension will be created for you. You should receive a welcome email with information on how to use the extension and how to configure it. From the extensions page, you can add additional users. Just click on add, select the extension number, add the extensions user's name, and add their email. On this page, you can also see the QR code, which will be used to provision their smartphone application. It is very easy for your employees to just use a browser to log into the 3CX web client and start communicating instantly. All they need is their extension number and the password from the welcome email. From here, they will be able to see who is available and call them accordingly. For those employees on the move, they can just as easily connect using their own smartphone. All they need to do is download the 3CX app from the Apple App Store or from Google Play. When they run the app, it will ask them for a QR code to provision the app. They can find this QR code in their welcome email or the 3CX web client. They can find the QR code as an attachment on their welcome email like this or like this. They can also find it from their web client under settings and scan QR code. It is also available in the menu on the top right by scanning QR code. And yes, they can have their extension running on both the web client and their smartphone. Using the 3CX web client and the 3CX smartphone applications, users can chat between themselves using the inbuilt chat functionality of 3CX. They can start a chat just by clicking on the chat icon under the user's presence. Or they can compose a chat like this and they can search for multiple people as well and have a group conversation. And just like that, very easily, they have had a chat conversation. They have transferred a file as well and going about their business. Alternatively, you can also utilize the web meeting capabilities of 3CX to allow you to collaborate with colleagues and external associates. Creating a web conference is very, very simple and is just a few clicks away. All you need to do is either schedule a video conference and invite your participants or enter into a video conference and invite people. Click on schedule conference, schedule a video conference. It can be now or scheduled for later. Just enter a subject, add some notes to the participants of what the web meeting will be about. This can be a collaborative web meeting 
or it can be a webinar in the form of a classroom with one presenter and multiple participants. You can add the participants that you want and click on Create Meeting. From here, you can very easily join the meeting. From here, you can very easily open up your camera, your microphone, and collaborate with your participants. You can also share a PDF if you want to make a presentation. And you can also very easily transfer a file. WebMeeting has whiteboard capabilities as well. And you can also share a screen. This will allow you to share a screen of your computer. It will allow you to share an application on your computer, or you can share a browser tab. From here, you can very easily invite participants on the fly as well. Just click on invite people and you can add people as you go. You can very easily just send them the open link as well. So all they need to do is just click on this link and they will be able to join you. And yes, it's as simple as that. So what about communicating with the outside world? You can very easily set up a SIP trunk on your 3CX. 3CX supports a variety of providers from all around the world. You can see the list on our website. The setup is very easily done from the SIP trunks. Click on add SIP trunk, select your country, select your provider, and enter your main trunk number. This is given to you by your provider. For our supported providers, all the necessary configuration is in the templates. All you need to do is authenticate. In order to make calls, you will also need to have your outbound rules. This will be a very simple rule to allow everyone to make an outgoing call. If you need to allow outgoing calls to a different country other than the one you are in, you will be able to do that from the security settings. You will need to do this from the allowed country codes. From here, you can select any country you wish to make calls to. These are just the basics to get you up and running. Thank you for your attention and please stay safe.